we should begin from here. It is informed that on a precarious mountainside, there was a hawk's home containing four huge bird eggs. At some point, a quake shook the mountain, making one of the eggs fold down into a chicken coop in the valley underneath. The chickens realized they needed to safeguard the hawk egg. In the long run, the falcon brought forth and a lovely bird was conceived. The chickens raised the falcon as one of their own. The hawk partook in its home and family, yet it appeared to have a soul that needed to shout stronger than simply a chicken's spirit. At some point, the hawk gazed toward the sky and saw a gathering of sublime falcons taking off high. Gracious, cried the bird, if by some stroke of good luck I could take off like those birds. The chicken saw the bird and said, You can't take off like them. You are a chicken, and chickens can't fly. The hawk kept on looking at its actual family overhead, longing for being like them. Each time the falcon discussed its fantasies, it was constantly informed that it couldn't make it happen. Furthermore, that is the thing the bird figured out how to accept. After some time, the bird quit dreaming and returned to carrying on with its life as a chicken. Ultimately, subsequent to carrying on with a long life as a chicken, the bird kicked the bucket, abandoning a message. In the event that you can become what you accept, battle earnestly and each breath you have. Assuming you at any point longed for turning into a hawk, follow that fantasy, don't follow what the chickens say. I trust this interpretation actually catches the embodiment of the story.